the journey to the hills of western Uganda starts at this point. And they drive through Queen Elizabeth National Park, bumpy and dusty roads, comes with large obstacles. Our interest, though, is not the giant mammoth, but rather the craters. Uganda has more than 70 of them. Some of these crater lakes were formed thousands of years due to volcanic activity. They used to be visited by researchers, but now tourists have discovered them as major attractions. This group traveled from Italy and Spain. And this area is obviously attractive. Uh, all my clients, are, all my group is astonished by the beauty of this landscape. And all the time, every time I come here, uh, I see their faces smiling at this place. And Some rocks and vegetation are unique to this savanna setting. Scientists say they are evidence of earth formation from geological activity that happened millions of years ago. Although they are extinct volcanoes, they still have a very large ecological value to the ecosystem, like they are inhabited by several primate species. Why some craters have turned into lakes, others have become thick forests. The basin-like structures and depressions offer beautiful views. It is this rare landscape that Uganda is using to diversify from animal tourism, which has sustained the sector for many years. Hilara Yesiga, CGTN, Kasesi, Western Uganda.